Haya, naye gavana wa kaunti ya Machakos Dr. Alfred Mutua ametangaza azma yake ya kugombea urais mwaka 2022. Mutua amesema anagombea urais ili kutoa suluhisho kwa changamoto nyingi zinazokabili taifa hili kwa sasa. Mutua amedai kuwa miaka 60 baada ya uhuru ndoto ya kuwa na Kenya yenye ufanisi ambapo hakuna mtu wa kuachwa nyuma ambapo bidii ya mtu hutambuliwa na ambapo ndoto za watu hutimia ingali ndoto hadi sasa. Gavana wa kaunti ya Machakos Dr. Alfred Mutua amezindua azma yake ya kuwa ni ya urais. Dr. Mutua amesema atagombea kiti cha urais mwaka 2022 ili kunusuru taifa hili ambalo amedai kuwa inasambaratika kimaendeleo. In the general elections of 2022, I, your son, your brother, one of you, Alfred Nganga Mutua will vie to be the next president of the Republic of Kenya so as to return Kenya to the railway tracks of where we were meant to be after independence Kulingana na mtu wa Kenya wamechoka na mfumo wa uongozi ambao umewapa uongozi duni kwa miaka mingi Gavana huyo wa Machakos amesema Kenya ni nchi yenye heshima lakini mtindo wa siasa na aina ya viongozi wanavyochaguliwa umesababisha nchi hii kuendelea kuteseka huku ikiwa na mabonyenye wachache na mamilioni ya wakenya wachochole Are you happy with the way things are going on in our country Kenya Is Kenya a fair country where you are treated equally when you seek opportunities and jobs? Amesema azma yake ni mwanzo wa uongozi mpya. Enzi mpya na kipindi kipa cha uongozi bora na maisha bora. Mtu amedai kuwa machozi ya furaha iliyoshuhudiwa wakati wa uhuru yamegeuka kuwa machozi ya uchungu na mahangaiko. Na wakenya hawana matumaini tena bali wamegubikwa na hofu na taharuki. Mtu amekero na siasa duni zinazoendelea hapa nchini na kwamba wakati umewadia kwa kiongozi chipukizi mbunifu na mwenye ukomavu mtu anayefahamu mfumo bali si mtumwa wa mfumo huo kuongoza taifa hili Kenyans want a leader who does not have baggage a leader who is not divisive a leader who does not hold grudges a leader who will move with all Kenyans despite their tribal regional economic and social status Amaidi kuongoza Kenya hadi katika upeo wa maendeleo huku kibuni nafasi milioni tano za kazi katika kipindi cha miaka mitatu ya kwanza ya uongozi wake ujenga barabara katika kila eneo bunge na kulinda zile zilizomo ili kubuni mazingira safi ya ukuaji our education will produce young and dynamic citizens who will find jobs waiting for them we will roll back poverty and restore dignity to all regardless of where you are born or your social or political dispensation mtu ameahidi kupunguza ufujaji wa mali na kuwezesha jamii ya wafanyabiashara kutia fora katika mazingira safi na huku akitumia kibwagizo chake cha kusema tunahitaji kuanza upya mtu amesema siasa zake hazitahusu kuhamasisha makabila bali kuhamasisha uchumi na kuangamiza umaskini sasa ni wakati wa fresh uwe mukami au mwikali uwe Suzana au Katerina Jerry au Lawino Fatma au Wafula wewe ni mkenya dondoka juu mambo ni fresh na mtua huku siasa za mwaka 2022 zikizidi kushika kasi na wanasiasa wakizidi kusakata rumba la siasa kabla ya kinyang'anyiro hicho imebainika wazi wazi kwamba swala la ufisadi ambalo limelemaza na kudumaza uchumi wa taifa hili ndilo swala ambalo lazima lishughulikiwe ili taifa hili liweze kupiga hatua kubwa kimaendeleo swali ni jii dr alfred nganga mtua anatosha kuongoza taifa hili na kuchukua hatamu za uongozi kutoka kwa rais Uhuru Kenyatta Timothy Kipnosu Darubini ya Channel 1 kutoka kaunti ya Machakos